Hi, my name is Randy Nordell, and this video is about the Microsoft 365 Office applications um, and differentiating between the desktop version and the browser-based Office Online. If you're in a, uh, a course where you're using the Office applications, you're going to want to use the desktop version of those. And as a student, you get Microsoft 365 free both the browser-based and the desktop version. So this is the desktop version. Right, main reason you want to use this is full functionality. Your, uh, you, all the functions, all the different features are available in the desktop version. In the browser-based online version, some of those features are missing. So you won't have, won't, it is not full functionality. Um, you typically launch the, um, the desktop version either from the taskbar of its pin there or from the start menu it, where you can open up the Excel or any of the other uh, Microsoft 365 uh, desktop version of the Office applications. So that this is the desktop version. The Office online version looks and feels very similar. So some of the differences that you'll see. So first of all, you'll see it, it's in a browser tab up here. The file name is in a browser tab. Second thing is you'll see a URL for the file here. So, um, so that's different than the desktop version. The backstage view is not as robust, not as much information on the backstage view. And you'll also notice that the app launcher up in the upper left here is available, which is not available in the desktop version. The other thing is some of the features are not in the Office Online browser-based version are not available. So you'll want to use the desktop version. And as a student, you get the desktop version free. So what you do is if you log into office.com with your uh, student account, your student credentials, it will bring you to this page. This is the Microsoft 365 page. And what you will do is if you click the install apps button, you'll be able to install the desktop apps. They're called either premium Microsoft 365 apps. Sometimes it will just say, it'll just say Microsoft 365 apps, but it'll be here, this install apps button, and this is where you download and install it. Um, one last thing I'll show you on the desktop version is on the backstage view, you could tell which version that you have. If you go to um, the backstage view and choose account, you here on Excel, you can see which version you're using and which channel. Current channel is the most common. It's the channel that's updated uh, typically once a month. Typically, the second Tuesday of every month will be some updates. And you can also see the version that you're using. And the version number corresponds, the first two numbers correspond to the year, 2023. The second two numbers correspond to the month, 11, which is November. So, so this was last updated in November of 2023. So this is the desktop version again, and that's on the backstage view. Again, you can install those by signing into your office.com account, clicking the install apps button and downloading the premium Microsoft 365 apps, or it might just say Microsoft 365 apps. I hope this is helpful. Have a great day.